hello to my life It's a little strange, but that's okay Along with my life comes the drama Good or bad, there's always karma Along with my friends comes the double Evil or not, there's still trouble Sometimes life takes a turn And everything goes up in a burn But it's alright Cause we all know That with the problem Comes the solution And with the solution Comes a lie With new friends And enemies too Hello This is me I'm a little weird But that's okay I was eight. I had just gotten home from my first soccer game. My mom was washing the dishes and my dad was fixing the car. I, on the other hand, was sitting in my room thinking about why I was a girl. I, I had never wanted to be a girl, but I've never wanted to really be a boy either. I've always considered myself neutral. My thoughts got interrupted when my mom told me that they were leaving to get more washer fluid for my dad's car and that I'd be home alone for a while. Parents came home an hour later and went to bed. Unfortunately for me, that was the last time I was going to see them. I woke up later that night to the smell of smoke because our heater had blown a fuse. I was able to contact help, but eventually the smoke got to me. I awoke in a hospital next to a police officer and a doctor. They had told me that my parents had passed away and that I'd have to go to America to live in an orphanage. I hated that idea so much, but I went. As soon as we got there, I ran. I ran so far that my side hurt. I found an alleyway, which I've made my home for about seven years. During times, I got into drugs and really bad habit. I smoked. I snorted. Did all kinds of bad things that I'm really not that proud of. When I turned 16, I learned how to take care of myself. And I went searching for food. I found this beaten up old car in a junkyard, so I fixed it up. And then I remembered my parents once telling me that they had relatives living in Bayertown Ridgewood. I've lived that I've lived with them since I was 18 and ever since my life has been really hard. You're the first person I've ever told that story to. I don't tell a lot of people my life story since they can be such pricks, honestly. So Consider yourself a lucky one. Wow. I... I'm sorry, Aspen. I had no idea your life was so hard. Yeah, no one really does, but... No one really cares, either. So, gonna be exposing this story. Star, get ready to tell your little friend goodbye. <laughs>